excited as you all know I've been on a weight loss journey the past couple of weeks and I'm a little bit more than halfway I would say or around about halfway um, I've been on like a weight loss journey for both my health and for the wedding of course and I thought I would show you like a little bit of what I've been eating I did a what I eat in a day recently that I will link down below for you as well but first we are going to be looking at some wedding dresses and Rain is going to come with me I know not very traditional and not very typical for the groom to come with but we got invited to the new collection launch within Bride & Co and yeah, I thought we could bring Yulifis along as well and go look at some dresses but first we need to get ready before we get dressed, I wanted to show you this shapewear from Bras and Things. Oh my goodness, so flattering. So like smoothing on the skin. I can't show you the whole thing, otherwise I'm gonna like expose myself. But oh my goodness, highly recommend. So definitely thinking all white it's a bridal launch of course we have to do all white and brain is gonna wear something blue which is really cute kind of cringy but really cute i love that idea bride and co actually has like a full suit like this i unfortunately didn't have time to go pick something out to wear so i thought i would just wear something of my own and then we will browse there maybe try some things on i'll show you this suit at bride and co when we get there later but they have like a full two-piece like a matching two-piece and this is quite similar i've had this jacket for a while and i've been on a weight loss journey it didn't fit me a couple of months ago so i'm gonna tr be trying it on for the first time since i started with my weight loss journey oh little update i lost 48 centimeters in total now and around my arms i think four two even around my wrist she didn't me uh, measure my wrists but i mean look at that i can literally put like a whole finger where my apple watch used to be like really really tight and i think like 16 centimeters around my waist how crazy is that so we're gonna try it on and before i get ready i love wearing this robe it's from adore couture i don't wear it every single day i'll wear like my um like warmer one on a day-to-day -day basis but whenever i'm getting ready for like a special event i just i love feeling cute as i'm getting ready so this one is from Adore Couture. I might be wearing this on our wedding day. Maybe just get like a new one. But I just, oh, I'm obsessed. I love the feathers. I love the way it feels on my skin. It's like butter. So highly recommend them. I will link them. Or you can even chop them in Edgar's How? Oh my goodness. I am so excited to be able to like form a relationship with brands and just walk like a road with them. And then they get to achieve such amazing things. Oh, it just makes me so happy. And even like Bride & Co. I've been with them for so long. And of course, I'm going to get my wedding dress from them. So there you have it, girls. We are doing Bride & Co. for the wedding and I'm excited to show you some of my favorite pieces tonight. But of course, I want to lose all of the weight before I do like a full-on fitting. So let's fit this on and put an outfit together and then we can leave. Something old. And we're gonna look for something new. <laughs> My rock. Your rock. But I'm not supposed to see your rock. I know, I said, I said. I said that you're not supposed. It's not like a traditional thing to do or very typical thing to do. But you shouldn't choose it now. We, like. No, I'm not gonna choose it now. We're just gonna look. Yeah, but like this is this is a new an event as well so yeah it's an event so we're not it's not us going out to going look. out looking for yeah. a dress and a suit it's just we're looking at the new collection <laughs> and also browsing 
I'm, I'm still not gonna know. You're not gonna no, tell me. No, 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 It's kind of crowded here, but I know you see me too. Everybody's singing, oh, everybody's singing, oh. I don't know what it is about you. It must be in the way you move. Just say you want me to. We've got nothing to lose. You're looking so old. You're looking so old. Baby, let me love you, let me love you Let me love you, let me love you Baby, let me love you, let me love you Let me love, let me love Baby, let me love you Just say the word and we can leave this place I'll take you anywhere you want Baby, let me love you. Livies, it's the next day. I um, took home a little dress from Bride and Co. Their dresses were stunning, by the way. This is a little bit of a different vibe than last night. Last night's dresses were obviously all white. I'm kind of bending over because <laughs> otherwise I'll expose myself. So last night's dresses were all like white. This is a gorgeous black dress. And since it's like women's month, I thought I would um, get a little bit of an early start. Not so early. Women's Day is next week. So I thought I would just get all of my content ready. I'm working with a couple of brands. So I'm thinking of like maybe doing this for bread for fruit and then i think i'm going to put together like a boss babes kind of black navy and red for my bid vest campaign so yeah you know, before the sun goes down <laughs> i thought we could do that Eyes. I don't know how, but it feels like I'm drunk on you It's almost like you make me fly And when I look at you smile I don't know how, but it feels like I'm drunk on you I got this absolutely stunning You can't even see them, they're so big Stunning bouquet of flowers from Carolina Herrera And they've been sitting here for a few days <laughs> I want to just like take some photos with them or like just share them with you and actually also smell it because it's been so busy but I have almost like all of the good girl fragrances oh my goodness I'm so excited maybe I should take a quick picture maybe I should take a quick picture but look how absolutely Stunning. Okay, let's open. Also, how stunning is this lippy? It's actually the Revlon Colorstay Matte Light Crayons. This one is in the shade uh, Air Kiss number 10, I think. Yeah, Air Kiss. So pretty. Such a powerful 
red. Oh my goodness, this is sealed up. So pretty. So this one is called Very Good Girl. Christmas? Like, how many days until Christmas? I saw a post on TikTok. It should feels like Christmas today. But we're celebrating us as beautiful women. Yay! Oh my goodness, I'm so excited to smell this. I have the the red one and then like the black one that looks like this. So this is the bottle. It's like a stiletto. And then it has like little sparkles on it. Gold heel. Okay, let's smell this. Oh, they all kind of smell similar. But this one has a bit of a fruitier, a fruitier scent to it. Where's the card? Oh, they wrote me a little a little note. It says, Dear Jessica, together is always better than one. That's a saying and concept that sisterhood represents. That only woman around the world understands. Good girl is not just one thing. She's sexy and she's strong. A fighter, a dreamer. She embodies all women and their multi faceted <laughs> sides oh that was a big word uh together they are unstoppable why not join the movement good good girls is calling you to be part of their good girls gang um it is how the fragrance is power of femininity a fearless and brilliantly bold fragrance that is that is defined by its sparkling cherry and stiletto ch cherry fragrance and stiletto bottle Love the Carolina Herrera team. Oh, oh, that is so cute. Oh, I love these blooms. I left them a bit too long, so I'm going to try and save them. And put them in water. fruit content it's been a day or two and tomorrow is um woman's day so i don't know if you've noticed but i haven't posted brutal fruit in a couple of weeks <laughs> and i just really wanted to like focus on my diet 100 percent and i can't believe that it's been um I'm in my 10th week of my eating plan and my diet and everything and I'm kind of near the end, the end before the end. <laughs> so um, I'm kind of like, I still have a couple of weeks to go, I think like three or four weeks, but I'm kind of nearing the like maintenance stage where I just kind of learn to live like a more balanced lifestyle and just kind of enjoy the things that we enjoy like a little spritzer saturday so i um am so excited to just be back with a bang with a beautiful powerful strong woman focused bang 
buying so my content brutal fruit loved it by the way and um, my focus for my content was kind of I know I'm in a dress and it's all glamorous and all of that um, but I wanted to um, oh and I'm taking the dress back today and B is actually coming and we are gonna be looking at just like browsing some dresses quickly as we take back that dress it's not a, like an official try on we're just gonna look at some dresses and then we're gonna head to Santon I want to go to Jimmy Choo but yeah my focus for Brutal Fruit was to the angle of you know we as women the dress doesn't make us as a woman it's our ideas it's our thoughts it's our passion it's the way we live our life so that was really my focus and just to like celebrate you celebrate us because we're worth celebrating and i'm just so excited so tomorrow is women's day and b's coming over she's bringing um my little boy <laughs> my god child oh my goodness i don't get to see him that often so we really have to like make time to you know see him um, because otherwise he will literally grow up past us um he's at that stage i actually want to show you a video it's so cute he's at that stage now where he's starting to like talk not like talk but like he's showing emotion and it's so cute so yeah they are um coming in just a little bit so i'm finishing off my um my makeup and yeah we're gonna go to um mango and like i said we're gonna walk the diamond walk i had no idea that we had a jimmy Choo in south africa i don't think i've ever walked the full diamond walk i always just go to louis vuitton gucci and i think i've been into burberry and that's about it i've never like walked the whole diamond walk and i don't think b has so yeah i'm really excited it's gonna be such a fun day um yeah we just have to like enjoy these moments obviously like work is important <laughs> but you know what we will never get these moments again like we will never get to enjoy this baby boy and like me and my sister we just have i mean she she's my sister and she literally feels like my sister and um it's like i every chance i get i want to spoil her because she means so much to me so um yeah i'm working on a campaign with mango and um the first i'm gonna do like two shopping trips with them or like shopping occasions one with um like a woman i love obviously would have loved to bring my mommy but she she's shopping with us <laughs> um in her own angel presence um and um then i get to bring one of you ladies to shop with me so by the time this video goes up my brutal fruit content will be up my mango content will be up so please show it some love and um yeah i'm so excited to meet i love meeting you ladies like i feel like now that covid is kind of like i don't want to say covid is like done but now that we don't have to wear masks and um whenever i see you it's just so exciting it's so exciting and um i'm excited to bring you along the day i'm gonna finish up get dressed and then we can go and i can show you my baby nephew
back a little while ago, cuddled the baby a bit, had some lunch, and uh, B and baby just left. They don't want to like hit traffic or anything, and obviously they have their routines. But I wanted to show you what I got from Mango, and I have um, some content to shoot before the sun goes down. I wasn't too happy with my bed face content that I shot the other day. So I tried to like add a bit on, onto my makeup and I wanted to do like a red lip and get dressed and just refilm that content quickly. But I wanted to show you what I got. So we ended up getting this black jumpsuit. It is so stunning. Oh my goodness. She looks incredible. She had a baby three months ago. Like what? She just looks so stunning. Um, and she got these like little sneakers. We both tried them on. They're so cute. But when I saw these boots, I was like, I am gonna wear these boots i want to like base my outfit around them and they had my size so i was so happy and i am definitely gonna get so much wear out of this the remainder of winter we only have like a month and a little bit to go but definitely something that you can wear in winter and like transitioning seasons either with whatever you know jeans or even a dress or like a skirt i feel like boots looks so nice with a dress and a skirt and especially that boot it's just so stunning with this dress by the time this video goes up my content will be up already this dress on is stunning i am just oh such a good piece to have and then when i saw this i was like this is so me like this is a jersey or like a little this is a trikey you know this is so me. It has shoulder pads. It has like little gold buttons, like a little fake pocket. So this, with that over or with anything else, this is just such a staple to have. So yeah, I got that. I'm gonna quickly get changed. Maybe I can even wear this. I don't know. I'll get changed, add a little bit onto my makeup, and then just quickly film um, my bit based content. <laughs> my dress on that I got from Mango and also the little jersey and the boots I'll show you in a second it looks so cute but I'm on my way to an appointment with Breitritz because yeah we were busy planning the wedding um, and they're obviously like helping me with some planning and assistance so I'm really excited um, we're gonna just have a meeting like this every two to three weeks just so that we we can like obviously touch base but yeah we're very much still like in the like quotation uh phase of the wedding like getting quotes like showing them pictures of what i want and if i don't know what i want um kind of brainstorming and seeing what would be the best option what would fit the venue what would fit both our styles and yeah i'm excited to share that with you so nothing much as of yet but i mean it's gonna start very very soon i really want to share everything with you but we're very much like in the beginning stages where we're just getting a lot of quotes um but i can once i get there i can try and show you some things i watch you as you dry do you know i'm looking and i can't help but smile do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on I put my feet up We are having a little early dinner Just loving this moment Can always stay here forever 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 You as you drive, do you know I'm looking? 
looking. Good morning, ladies. I'm about to make the bed and get ready for the day. But before I end off the vlog, I wanted to show you what Bride & Co sent us home with. Um, obviously got two because Brain and I. So we got a little Bride & Co sleeping mask. Um, looks like a few vouchers. And then a little card that says thank you for attending our event. Team Bride & Co. And then we got a little thank you treat. Sally Williams. Which I'm not allowed to eat. And then um, this. I've heard of Nano Coco. And as far as I know, it's very similar to... What is it? Crayolin? So I'm not too sure about this brand. I've never really like tried it before. But we got an eyeshadow pencil. I don't know if Brain, <laughs> Brain's one is the same. I'm obviously going to use his. Besides the Sally Williams. Um, it's a gift voucher. And then we have professional makeup removing pads and then we have some like masks and then that eyeshadow pencil i wonder if the other one is the same yeah no this one has a lipstick let me try this no, i feel like this brand is pretty new let me know if you've tried it before oh that's a nice color let me know if you leafies have tried anything from this brand i've seen them on tiktok um but i don't think you can find them in store um i think they're very much like crayolin because it says professional makeup so i'm pretty sure like you have to be a trained artist to have these products i don't know let me know <laughs> in the comments um they're obviously like associated with bridal so i'm feeling like stage makeup vibes like long way proper professional makeup let me know what you know about them i don't know anything about them like i said i've seen them on tiktok a couple of times i've seen like a foundation that you have to blow with a hairdryer to put on it's like a coconut oil based kind of foundation i don't know um but let me know and let me know if you enjoyed this vlog um this lippy looks like a really nice lippy i'm not the biggest fan of a matte lipstick but the matte ones are a little bit longer wearing i'm wearing a stain right now from fenty it's like a like a stain and um, so it obviously like as it rubs off it still shows on the lips but i have my <laughs> lips blush tattooed so i mean that's fine and i'm just i'm so excited for the wedding for the fact that i won't have to like worry about my lips and like worry about lipstick touch up because all i have to do is maybe just put like a little bit of a gloss so i'm really excited i'm really excited for the wedding content um i just feel like it's going really slow and i wanted to thank you for being so patient with me i feel like um the first bit of getting quotes and getting like packages from all of the different vendors is really time consuming um and um, i try to show you like a little bit i have so many ideas but obviously i feel like you can't just do everything because it's only a short period of time like i have so many ideas and like tiktok saved and all of that so if you have any if you if you're married and you had a wedding recently or like obviously um and you have some things that you did at your wedding that you found that was really special any advice any tips you want to give the bride <laughs> your fellow future brides um i would really appreciate that so that i can just take that along with this journey and then we can share it with all of the other brides on yeah so let me know if you have any like do's and don'ts, things that you regret, like so many things. I feel like that's a good starting point for me also for this series because then I can take that and kind of incorporate it into my own planning and then share that with you leafies. But I have a couple of ideas, I have plans, but yeah, it's just coming along a little bit slower than I thought. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited to like pack on this journey with... Um, but I because they obviously know like the expertise and 
the different vendors they've worked with them before so i really trust them so i'm excited to like just go to them every few weeks and just like talk to them what i think and all of that but i feel like in the next couple of weeks we'll probably dive a bit more into like the theme and what I want, what I'm thinking. I have, like I said, so many ideas, um, but obviously don't want to like overdo it because we want to enjoy the evening. We want to keep it like minimal, traditional, and just like have it be about Brain and I. So I'm really excited to share all of that with you, ladies. Um, I'm going to wrap up this vlog. Thank you for watching. Thank you for being part of this beautiful Leafy family that we have. And I'm excited to see you in the next one. Mwah! Love you, Libby. Bye.